This book is called, Is God in the Garden? Ben thought about it at night when he said his prayers, in the morning when he ate his cereal, and on Sunday when he went to church. Finally, one day at breakfast, Ben said to his big sister, Allie, I want to meet God. But God is invisible. You cannot see God, said Allie. Allie knew a lot, but she didn't know everything. Only God knew everything. We can look in the Bible, said Ben. Rocky can help. Rocky does have a nose for adventure, said Allie. It looks like he's ready. Woof! Where are you going? asked Mr. Jelly. He was washing his store window. We are going to meet God in the Bible, said Ben. Bring a flashlight, said Mrs. Bean. She was sweeping her shop sidewalk. I have one, shouted Allie. Rocky, lead the way, Ben and Allie shouted, and so off to the Bible they went. Where are we? It's dark. I'm scared. Ben could hear Allie's voice, but he could not see his sister. Ben could not even see himself. Allie, where are you? Ben called. I don't know, but Rocky found me. Good boy, Rocky. I knew we could count on you. Rocky, is God here in the dark? asked Ben. Then came a very big voice. Let there be light. I can see now, said Allie. It's beautiful, but I don't see God. I don't see God either, Ben said, but I see the sun and all the animals. I see the fish in the ocean and the birds in the air. Look, there's a man and a woman, said Allie. They look happy. Maybe they know where God is. So Allie asked the man and the woman, do you know where God is? God is here, said the man. God made this beautiful garden. God is here, said the woman. God made the man, and God made me. God gave us grain and fruit to eat, said the woman. We have not seen God, but God gives us food. God gave the animals and the birds what they need, too, said the man. We have not seen God, but God takes care of all living things. God gave us each other, said the man and the woman, and now we are never alone. And God gave, God gave us choices, said the woman. We can think, we can love, we can take care of the world that God made. And God gave Rocky perky ears and a wacky tail, said Allie. Uh-oh, where did Rocky go? asked Ben. I guess God gave Rocky some friends too, said Ben. We didn't see God, but we saw what God does, said Allie. I guess Rocky has a pretty good nose for adventure after all.